checking the stats every minute this week. I'm doing my part, I'm paying attention, and I play my position. It's Crypto Light, so we're back with another Zen crypto videos and many are going to be looking at the zen chart thinking what is going on people are asking when is the dump going to be over all right guys um i think it did pump a lot okay guys so it's bound to come down a lot what goes up must come down you can look at this as a buying opportunity or a minting opportunity okay guys um you know at the end of the day you know this is a long-term project in my opinion it's a long-term hold so i'm not looking at this and worrying to be honest there's going to be lots of pumps and dumps along the way i believe in zen okay it's got a huge community it's got great tokenomics um some would argue it doesn't have great tokenomics it's super inflationary but you know there's a lot of burning going on that's what i mean when i say that um you know it's free mint it's fair launch it's all things good about crypto it's decentralized okay guys so in the long run as more people talk about it as uh, you know, more things are being built around it. I believe that in the long term, this is going to do really well, which is why I'm making so many videos about it. Not because this is a short term pump and dump. This is a long term project. Okay, guys. Now in the macro, okay, guys, when you come over and you zoom out in the long run, right, you're going to be looking back potentially, right, potentially, it's just speculation, but you're going to be looking back thinking, you know, what? this is, this was absolutely nothing, right? Absolutely nothing okay guys when you see zen start doing crazy things like this right crazy things like this right crazy pumps like that you're gonna be thinking yo that was absolutely nothing nothing right so you know i want you to have a bigger vision and a longer term view on this particular project because this is if you think about hex for example hex pumped so many times and it dumped so many times, 85%, okay? That happened time and time again. Time and time again, there's going to be people that got shaken out. There's going to be people that thought, you know what? It's over. You know, I bought the top. It dumped and so on. All right, guys. But in in a matter of two years, I believe it did 10,000x. 10,000x? 10,000x, okay, guys? So can Zen do 10,000x? We don't know. Um, but in crypto, we know that tokens or coins can do that all right guys we have the x1 blockchain coming or the x1 uh devnet or mainnet right we have that coming we have more projects being built on the uh ecosystem coming right we have zen doge we have you know uh, um, uh burning all that sort of stuff all right guys so there's a lot of things to come for this project um dxn for example dxn um, I did get out of DXN, okay, or DBZN, right? Um, let's have a look at what the chart is looking like right now. So I got wrecked on DBZN, okay? Um, but, you know, it's, it's not to take your eye off the ball. The main token in this ecosystem is Zen, okay, guys, Zen. So I got into DBZN around here. It pumped, it came down, you know, it, 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 it pumped a little bit. It, it had a little bit of a bounce. So I got out. Okay, guys, and that was a good move because since then it's fallen further. I made some passive income on, on Ethereum, okay, but I did take a loss. I, I'm not sure how much of a loss that I took. I think it was about, maybe about, you know, 20, maybe about 30%, um, you know, so it was a loss, okay, guys. But, um, you know, at the end of the day, uh, you've got to know when to sell and when to hold. And DXN or DBs, and it just, just doesn't quite have the momentum that it had in the beginning the excitement it had in the beginning in my opinion okay guys but um zen you know i don't believe the excitement and the uh you know the the passion for this project is going away in my opinion it's super early okay and again we're going to see lots of this lots of this okay this is just the beginning in my opinion right it's just the beginning okay jack levin continues to build he's like a madman when he gets on a computer and, um, you know, I believe he's launching on Arbitrum next, Arbitrum or Optimism. So, um, yeah, my opinion, just keep your eye on the ball. It's a very quick video. All right, guys, I'm going to ask you to leave your comments down below. Let me know what you think. Are you still holding Zen or have you kind of gave up on Zen? You know, I'm not giving up on Zen. I believe that there's a long way to go for this project. And uh, let's just see where it is in a year from now, two years from now. OK, guys, um, one strategy you can just do is just mint. OK, just mint and um, collect those tokens okay you can mint nfts on various blockchains you can mint and um you know that's just delayed gratification you cost you nothing but a gas fee it's free 
okay guys and that is the lowest risk strategy you can use for zen but um you know if you have more risk tolerance what you can do is you can buy zen buy the dips okay guys if it's not financial advice do your own research don't risk more than what you can afford to lose that being said is the end of the video so let me know what you think in the comments subscribe to the channel if you're not subscribed already like the video tick the little bell for notifications when you subscribe and i'll see you in the next video